Hello all, and welcome to Night Rips. So as you can see, I've actually uh, been restocking my supplies. We got some plenty of content in the future, but decided today I'm going to open up some product I've never, actually most of this I've never even seen before. Uh, just some of the random packs that I get, all of them from 1991. So uh, I've got a pack of this Conlon collection from the Sporting News which is going to be interesting. I know of this product. I've never opened it, but they're a 1991 Premier Baseball by Opechi, which is cool. It's a Canadian product. This one is a company called Pacific. They're Nolan Ryan Texas Express cards. Kind of an interesting foil pack. I don't know. And then the last one is some AAA pre-rookie 1991 uh, line drive. There is some good ones in this potential. Of course, not, you know, this is actually, from what I understand, is a relatively large set. Yeah, 650 cards. I've got 12. But this should be fun. So why don't we just get ripping? So I want to start off, start off with this Conlon collection. Now, these, I have looked, they're photographs by this photographer last name's Conlon so most of these are going to be Hall of Fame uh, you know old cards from the 20s and 30s or old players that is I can get it ripped open yes I can't there right. you go of the sporting news produce these cards and I've never seen them before so this is this should be entertaining <clears throat> so Hall of Fame 1968 Joe Medwick 1926 Cardinal Flint Rem MVP from 1913 Jake Daubert that's cool uh, 1934 Washington Senators John Stone all-time leader, Pinky Higgins from 1938. Carl Hubble, all-time leader, 1936. Ivy Wingo, catcher from the Reds and from 25. It's a really neat cards. Bob Smith, pitcher for the Boston Braves, 1936. Roy J. Johnson from the Yankees. Can't, can't forget that uniform. 1936. Lloyd Brown from the Cleveland Indians. 1935. Heine Groh. 1916. 75 years ago league leader. Again, this was... This card set was from 1991. Uh, oh, here you go. From the Boston Red Sox. The pitcher, Babe Ruth. 1916. Wow. The babe. Very cool. Earl Whitehill, 1924 pitcher for the Detroit Tigers. Wilkie Moore, 1927 Yankees pitcher. Rube Wahlberg, the Philadelphia Athletics pitcher, 1924. Got the nice elephant there. Adam Komorski, Outfielder for the Reds, 1934. Ed Rausch, Hall of Fame, 1962, but he this was a Giants, 1927. And Casey Stengel, Stengel, 1924, Hall of Fame, 1966. That's a stoic look on them. These are really neat cards. And of course, the Boston Braves. Go, Bo go Braves. Very neat. Yeah, I've never seen this pack before. I suppose we had a decent sized pack at the set, so those are those are interesting. So let's see, what do we open next? How about we open Nolan Ryan, the Texas Express from Pacific? And yeah, this is a very odd pack. Uh, 
Uh, very interesting. Not all, not all that easy to get open either. Kind of try to save some of these wrappers because it'd be interesting to see what I've got. So let's see what we got. There we go. Cards get sticky when they're 30 years old. All right, we got the Gentleman Rancher. Because Nolan Ryan, of course, being a Texas guy, yeah, he's a... Uh, has to have his horse. A new ball for a new Nolan. Nice Ranger shot. The Spring Workout. I wonder if all these are going to be the Texas Ranger cards. Absolutely not. It was a 3,000th career strikeout when he was an Astro. Or when he was a rookie pitcher with the New York Mets. Very cool. Uh, no, no hitter number one, back when he pitched for the Angels. 16 career low hitters. Because he only did seven no hitters. Milestone strikeouts. So let's see what they can show. Yeah, all the way up to his thousandth strikeout, which happened August 22nd, 1989. And he struck out Mr. Ricky Henderson. Ranger Club record of 16 strikeouts. What was that? April 26th. Wow. So he actually had 16 strikeouts twice since he turned 40. Nolan was the man. He sets a Mets record for strikeouts. Ryan's routine between starts. I guess you could do that. If you freeze that a little bit. You see what it takes for him to loosen up. Oh, and this is all authorized by Nolan Ryan. This is cool. And Ranger battery mates. All right, that was a cool set. I know there was some. There is some uh, chrome type with this. Obviously, we didn't get any of those. Now, let's take a look at 1991 Opeji. I do know what's neat about these. these are, this is a Canadian product. And uh, what's really neat about Opeji is, you know, I mean, you can see it right at the front when it says seven cards, cartes, which means basically because this is a Canadian product, you know, it is tops, but they, uh, they print all their cards in both English and French. And they, okay. Let's say they made packs that are really, really tough to get into. Let's see who we got. Oh, these are nice looking cards too. Willie Wilson, athletics outfielder. And I don't speak French or else I would butcher that really well. Oh, that's pretty nice. Nice color picture on the back, too. Dave Stibe for the Blue Jays. Oh, 1998, 18 and 6. 125 strikeouts, 2.93 ERA. That's not too bad. Willie Frazier. Blue Jays pitcher. I played with the, eight, the Angels in 1990. Lance Dickerson or Dixon, Cubs pitcher. Kurt Gibson, which was who is with the Royals here. Kirk was a longtime tiger. You know, he was the Dodgers before the because he went Tigers, the Dodgers, and then to the Royals. And then Eric Davis, great hitter. Uh, 
All right, not bad. Interesting. Nice colored card on the back. I mean, obviously you always have the colors on the front, but the nice color on the backs pops too. Very cool. All right, one more pack. This one I'm actually looking forward to because obviously you you know we're so used to the Bowmans, the tops, you know the all the rated rookie star rookies, RCs. This is before before any of that. So potentially get I know of a few names in this one that would be really neat to find. Let's see if we get any of them. Of course. You, know, you got the American Association of Professional Baseball Clubs because this is all minor league product. You know, you do have an MLB logo down here. So, who we get? Rob Nelson with the Vancouver Canadians. All right. Jeff Pico, the Coma Tigers. Uh, he had been around for quite a while. Angel Gonzalez, Nashville Sounds. Pat Wernig, Tacoma Tigers. Pete McCannon, Nashville Sounds manager. Manager card. I don't know what they show on the back of these. Uh, I guess just where they were working. Kevin Kennedy. Albert Kirky Dukes. Dave Richardson. The Louisville Redbirds. Bien Figurina. Aroa, sorry. Louisville Redbirds. Dennis Cook with the Albuquerque Dukes. Looks more like a manager than a pitcher, but... Dean Palmer, the Oklahoma City 89ers. Steve Peters, the Oklahoma City 89ers. And finally, Derek May, the Iowa Cubs. So nothing that jumped right out at me. I know... Tino Martinez has a card in this set. Um, also, Mike Mussina has a card in this set. And for a manager, so does Phil Necro, the late Phil Necro. So, but obviously we didn't get any of those. Well, this was fun. So, nothing, nothing too big. Obviously, you know, getting the Babe Ruth, that was kind of neat. Um, but we, we have a lot more packs to open up. And, you know, in the future, I've also got a couple boxes of the 1990 wax packs, high edition uh, upper deck. So we are going to be trying to find the Reggie in the future. So, you know, thanks for watching and make sure you go ahead and hit that bell, hit that subscribe button so that whenever my next video comes up, you'll be one of the first to know and get to watch to see if we actually got Reggie. Thanks for everyone for watching. Bye now.